Hi everyone, Dr. Ariane here. I wanted to do a video on the toe touch pattern, um, how to assess it, what we're looking for, and then three exercises that are my favorites uh, that can help to improve that pattern. So of course, if you have pain with anything, this is not applicable for you. This is if you do not have pain in this pattern. So in the toe touch pattern, uh, when we're assessing it, feet together, and if you're reaching down, of course, to touch your toes, and what we're looking for is a weight shift in the pelvis. So just a natural, we call just a natural posterior weight shift and a uniform curve in the spine. So does everything look like a nice, nice uh, clear curve or does it seem like it's straight and then bent? So again, just a nice weight shift, a little bit of a toe touch pattern. A lot of times what we'll see is there's no weight shift in the pelvis and everything comes from the low back. So this is the person that has not been able to touch their toes their whole lives. <laughs> um, so we see this pretty frequently. Um, or you could see any other variation of that. Um, but those are the key things that we're looking for just to keep it simple. So three of my favorite exercises for this is to improve the sequencing and coordination of the movement, the stability, in the actual in the full pattern so this is actually a weight shift which is a balance reaction so if everything comes from the upper back that means that we're not getting a good weight shift or balance reaction so the first exercise is called the rock so you're going to get down to the ground you're going to have your knees wide so you can go whatever feels comfortable i would say like a frog position and then you're going to have your elbows wide here <laughs> You're going to keep your eyes at your fingertips and you're going to inhale as you go back, maintaining a neutral spine here. And then exhale as you come slightly forward, belly button goes in towards the spine. And you just rock back and forth nice and slowly. That one's really great for uh, the nervous system. The rocking is really uh, soothing to the nervous system, but it also works on that weight shift and reflexive stability in the trunk, as well as the uh, stability in the shoulder and girdle. So the next one is called the cat. So you're gonna get into an all fours position. You wanna have a really active hand, so the index finger parallel to each other. From here, you're going to round your back as much as you can. So you're really trying to tuck from the pelvis here, okay? And then from this position, you're gonna take your inhale, and on your exhale, you're gonna push the ground away. So you're pushing really tall, really activating all the serratus, which goes into the uh, diaphragm. And then you hold that for about three to five breaths. Big inhale, abdominal expand. Exhale, really push the ground away. And then the last one is a toe touch progression. So you would have some kind of board, two by four works awesome. Um, if not, just books work just as well. You're gonna put your toes up on the board and yoga block, a pillow, um, towel, something in between your legs. From here, you're gonna inhale as you bring your arms down. Exhale, as you reach down to touch your toes. Okay, so my hair's getting in my way. <laughs> and you're gonna do uh, 10 of those, okay? You bend your knees just as much as you need to to be able to touch, but no more than that, okay? So you do wanna touch your toes every time. Then the next one was heels up, toes down, and the same idea. Okay, so just inhale. Exhale as you reach down, bend your knees just as much as you need to. Then, of course, after you finish, go ahead and check your toe touch again and see how that feels. You should be a little bit further if not touching the ground, depending on if your issue is more stability driven. Uh, these are three great exercises, some of my favorites. Again, they are not appropriate if your toe touch pattern is painful. So just make sure that it is pain free before you begin these exercises, otherwise it could make it worse. All right, thank you so much and have a great day. Hope that helps.